It is 644 right now. Welcome back into Good Morning Maryland. I'm Christian Schaefer. Now, earlier this month on Giving Tuesday, we told you about a massive donation to a nationwide organization that's helping Gold Star families find purpose by helping others. Now more donors have responded, adding thousands to the total for the Travis Mannion Foundation, which sends the families of service members who were killed in combat on volunteer missions around the country, even internationally, all expenses paid. A day of service in Baltimore City led by a local couple still coping with a tragic loss. Valerie was um, an extraordinary young woman. Valerie Capillare Delaney grew up in Howard County, graduated from the Naval Academy, and became a Navy pilot. Call sign mom. That tells you a lot about her desire to, to keep the whole team or squadron or together to do something better. But in 2013, the jet she was piloting on a training mission crashed in eastern Washington state. Valerie was killed instantly. It was really hard. I mean, you, we just could not understand what happened. The Capillaris eventually found the Travis Mannion Foundation, which sends the families of fallen members of the military on service missions, not just in Baltimore, but all over the country and around the world. The power of service is healing. Um, and through these service expeditions, we give these surviving family members the opportunity to be able to take that back in their lives and feel more connected and to be able to uh, give back. Travis Mannion was also a graduate of the Naval Academy. He joined the Marines, but was killed in Iraq back in 2007 while saving some of his teammates who'd been wounded in an ambush. At his funeral, members of Travis Mannion's family started talking about forming an organization focused on what they now call survivor expeditions. What they really latched on to was the phrase, if not me, then who? And this idea that we all have this capacity to create change in the community, and they wanted to live out that legacy by continu continuing to do that. On Giving Tuesday, the foundation announced that a private donor who wants to remain anonymous would be matching all donations through December 31st, dollar for dollar, up to $1 million. We have a tremendous hole to fill, and the only way we can fill it is by serving a donation that will allow more Gold Star families to serve with the selflessness of their loved ones. I knew for myself I wanted to curl up in a ball and not function, not do anything. What we found is you can do things to honor your loved one. You're doing something that's helping you to live again. Now, Travis Mannion's roommate at the Naval Academy was Brendan Looney of Southern Maryland. He became a Navy SEAL after graduation, but was killed in a helicopter crash in Afghanistan back in 2010. They're buried next to each other at Arlington National Cemetery. We have a link to the Travis Mannion Foundation's website on our website right now, WMAR2news.com.